What is that? Unbelievable family, what's going on, man? It's your boy Ryan back with another video. Good morning, y'all. It's early. I'm out here with the dogs. I just fed them, man, on their raw diet, y'all. They've been on the raw diet for about three days. Man, I'm telling y'all, they are loving it, and I see changes, man. I see big changes every time I feed them. Like I told y'all in the last video, I don't feed my dogs raw every um all the time, but I do it sometimes, and I'm telling you, every time I feed them the raw. I see the changes to make me think, why am I not just feeding them raw 100% of the time, man? You know, it's, it's a lot going through my mind, man, because I'm telling you, I see the changes. But anyways, y'all, today I got to give, um, I got to take Madison to the vet, y'all. She got to get some shots in. I'm going to tell y'all, man, I know it's a little too early to tell, but I know my dogs, and I actually think Dior took, man. Yes, I think Dior has took y'all i think dior is pregnant man her moods change um i think she took remember all the signs that i see i think she took it's too early to tell i should know about another 15 days but um so yeah fingers crossed on that but anyway let's get majesty ready because she got to go to the vet all right y'all i got queen majesty with me we are on our way to the vet she needs some shots um she need her rabies shots, and I'm going to get her deworm, and, you know, just to check up, make sure everything is good on her, man. Because, like I told y'all before, I will be breeding this girl to my boy Bank. Um, not Bank, I'm sorry. To Richie, my other fluffy. Um, so, yeah, she should be ready to... Let's go. go fly in here, man. Majesty, look at that girl, y'all. Why are you looking on my seat like that, girl? Um, yeah, she should be ready. I'm not sure, y'all, honestly. Um, I'm not gonna breed her on her first heat. It depends, right? Like I usually I know my dogs, man, and I and I, and I, I know when she should be going to heat and when she should be ready or whatnot. This girl here is about eleven months old. Um she hadn't had her first heat yet. You know, a lot of people don't realize that uh well, a lot of people honestly say that, you know, the dogs come in heat every six months, and some dogs do, but from my experience, you know, I can only speak from my experience, man. From my experience, my French Bulldog females, they first heat usually about 12 to 13 months, y'all, is when I get their first heat. Um, so she's about 11 months old, and she hadn't had her first heat yet. I won't be breeding her in her first heat. I never try to, I never breed my dogs on the first heat, man, because they're too, you know, they're too young. They're not mature yet. And her especially, she want to run around and play and bite on stuff and just play rough with everybody, biting on everybody. And that's just, you know, maturity. They're too uh, immature, you know what I mean? So she's not ready yet, and I don't recommend y'all breeding y'all dogs on the first heat, man. Let her develop. Let her get, you know, more mature to be a mom. Um, so, yeah, I got my girl with me. She's on our way to the vet. We are on our way to the vet. This is her first checkup since I've had her. So um, let's go see what the vet got to say about her, man, and um, we go from there. You ready for the vet, mama? Why are you on that chair like that? You ready to go see the vet? You ready to go see what the vet got to see, mama? You ready, huh? Let me see that girl. Calm down, girl. Majesty. To the puppy. Come here, girl. Come here. She's like, what is this? Where are we at? This is a new place for me. Come here, mama. Majesty. She's focused, y'all. Look at her. Focus. Hey, come here, girl. <laughs> come here. What are you doing? Come here. She just got weighed, y'all. She weighed 22 pounds, and she's not going to get any bigger, man. 
for a fluffy. Keep that in mind, man. For a fluffy, 22 pounds. She won't get any bigger than that. She is looking good. Everything looking good on her. They're going to do a deworm on her and then a her rabies shot. And we'll be out, out of here. Right there by my mom. Mm -hmm. She had a little water on her eye like she was crying. Like she like, no, I don't want to go to the bed. She's fine. Look at that girl. Look at that girl. Huh? Look at that mama. She love her little chin rub, huh? Look at that mama right there. Wait, am I seeing double? Mercy. Mercy. What are you doing back there? It's what? What? What's going on? All right, guys, let me tell you how crazy this is, man. It's a good thing we at the vet because she's up here and I'm just standing up, you know, rubbing on her, making sure she doesn't fall off while we wait on the vet. And I just noticed a cut on her back leg, man. I think y'all can see that. See that? Damn. What is that? So, it's a good thing we at the vet, man, so I can get that looked at, get some ointment for it or something. See what she think the cause of it is. Would have never noticed if I didn't. That's the thing with the fluffies, y'all. I mean, it's just eye-opener, right? Um, it's my first time owning fluffies. I got two of them. And, you know, on the regular Frenchies, it's so easy for you to spot stuff like that because they, they they're not they're not fluffy, right? But see, with her fluffy, it's so hard for you to notice something like that. Like, look, how would I have noticed that? See what I'm saying? Unless you're actually looking at it, but wow. Man, what is that? Wow, so we're going to get that looked at, get some ointment or whatever we need to do to get that taken care of. Right, Mama? Why you didn't tell me you was hurt? Why you didn't tell me you was hurt? How did you get hurt? Y'all playing rough back there. That's what I think it is. You and Richie, y'all two always playing rough. Running around, jumping, biting each other. So you need to be careful. So you don't hurt yourself. Wow. All right, man. It's a good thing we hit the vet. We're going to get that looked at and see what the vet think the cause was and what she recommend to get rid of that. Because we don't want nothing like that. Ain't that right, mama? All right, sweetheart. How's she been doing? Okay. She's been good. I just yeah. noticed the... I was telling her, I just noticed a cut on the back of her leg. Okay, I'm not that. sure how she got that. I know her and my other dog, Richie, wow, they play child. rough. I'm going to listen to her heart okay. first. You're a good girl. Hold on, sweetie. Her heart sounds good. Wow, child. today and her temperature was normal at 100.5. Hey, you want some? This is a dewormer. You want this? Okay. It tastes good. She said, yes, I will take that. It's a banana flavor. <laughs> mm -mm. You like it? Is it good? It looks like she's enjoying it. She does mm -hmm. like that. She looks like she's a pretty happy dog no matter she what. Is. Good girl. What about her ears? Is she scratching, shaking? No. They look a little dirty. Let me look down in there. Come on, sweetheart. Good girl. That's a good girl. Look at that energy. Oh, yeah. She's got a lot of waxy debris. Oh, cool. but that's out of your ear. Here. I'm going to get a sample of that. Show you what I'm seeing down in there. How long have you had her since she was... I've, no, I've had her about... I say three weeks, four okay, weeks so now. Start. Yeah, I just See got this. here. Yep. This is what's deep down in there. Mm -hmm. And that shouldn't be there. So we're going to look and 
We're gonna check for, I'm gonna check for ear mites first. Usually that if they have ear mites, they're pretty itchy. Yeah, I haven't seen her scratching or anything like that. So it can also just be a yeast infection. Mm -hmm. So we'll look and see, because it needs to be treated for whatever it is. Oh my goodness, look at that. Wow. Like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. It's bad. gross. Yeah, it's gross. Yeah. It's gross. Uh, let me hear, darling. Let's have some freeze dried flipper. Would you like that? She's <laughs> like, well, yes. I would like that. Good girl. Okay, all right. I've got her going there. <laughs> Distraction. I'm going to have to be fast though, because she's fast. Has she been spayed? No. Okay. Is that good? You still got her? You do have more, darling. Eat it up. Good girl. And she's got that back of the skin. She has that little abrasion on the back of the skin. Okay. I'm going to wipe this cheese up where she walks off of it. All right, let's see. Where was it? On her yeah, pad? Here, yeah. Oh, gosh. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Well, the good thing is, is it is, I mean, I don't know what caused it, but it's not all the way through. It's okay. not a full thickness, and that'll heal. I'll give you some ointment to put on that. Yeah, that's the What did you get me. into, sis? No. I think it's her and Richie. They play yeah. so rough. It gets on my nerves, but they're just playing. <laughs> my dogs do that. Everybody's always got some kind of a nick or a cut, or because they play hard. Now, do you have her on a heartworm? I don't, no. Okay. I want you to get her on a heartworm prevention. Maybe some kind. You can use heartworm and flea together, or okay. you can just use a heartworm. Okay. Uh, uh oh. I got you. I she didn't get that one more than her. So that was the medial aspect yeah. of her right hawk. So we went for ear mites, and I'm also. Girl. Why don't you sit down and relax yourself? Hmm? Why don't you sit? Why don't you sit down and relax? You can't sit down, huh? Okay, y'all, so the vet said Majesty has a little ear, um, yeast in her ears. So she said it could be caused from water getting in there or um, allergies. So she's going to give me some uh, liquid to put in her ear. She just did some herself. And she's gonna give me some. Do it once a week. Um, for I forgot what she said honestly, but she's gonna come back and give me all that info. And uh, besides that, my girl looking good. All right, y'all. We just got through with the vet. Two hundred and thirty-one dollars later, but it's worth it, man. Um, my girl's looking good. She got her rabies shot. Um, she had a little infection in her ears. I think I recorded that. Um, y'all might see it before this clip. Um, she had a little infection in her ears, so the vet gave me some treatment and stuff, man. So I got a bag, a baggie full of good stuff. Um, hang on, let me show y'all real quick. This for her ears right here. She said the infection can, uh, could have been caused from, um, you know, she said water being in her ear or allergies, man. So... We got some treatment for it once a week. Um, and I can do this for as long as I need to. And she said, the good thing about this is I can do this to all my dogs. So, hey, that's good. Um, and then she gave me some ointment for her little scratch on her leg that she said is going to heal. Um, she said, you know, I think y'all heard her. She said it's going to heal. That's not a big problem. And then um, this is for her ears also. I give her, it says uh, 0.5 in each ear twice a day for seven days so that's the help with her ear infection but besides that man she said majesty is looking good she is healthy um says she's full of muscles and everything else is looking good man so um 
again, I will be breeding Majesty with Richie, man, in the future. She's not ready yet, but we want to make sure she's a healthy dog before we can breed her and will breed her. Um, if she's not healthy to be bred, we won't breed her, man, because the dogs come first over here at Unbelievable Frenchies, y'all. Um, they are our number one priority, man. If they are not healthy enough and not in good health to breed, we won't breed them. Um, so, and, you know, I took a risk. I purchased this dog before I even took her to the vet and made sure of all that, you know. Um, but sometimes in life, you got to take risks, man. See, uh, they got her ears cleaned out, so that's why she keeps shaking it like that. Um, the vet says she's going to be fine. She said it's no uh, parasites or no mice or anything in her ears, so um, she's going to be good, man. But like I said, as long as she's healthy, ain't that right, mama? So we headed back to the house now, man. I just wanted to make a video so y'all can see this girl going to the vet, doing her first checkup with me in my possession. Um, I made a good decision getting her. She is a healthy dog. She is going to be a great um, part of the family, the Unbelievable family. So again, Unbelievable family, listen, to man, if it's your first time watching this video, please subscribe, y'all. Please give me a thumbs up. Comment below. Tell me what you think about my majesty. Tell me what you think about um, that vet bill, y'all. $231, man. <laughs> um, comment below. Please also, guys, turn on your post notifications, man, so you can be notified on when I am dropping videos. Make sure you turn on your post notification, please, so you can be notified on every video that I drop. I will be dropping more content, man. Um, like I said, I think Dior is pregnant, so I'll be taking y'all along that journey so y'all can see the entire process of her um until she deliver puppies man so again thanks for watching the video please subscribe to the channel please turn on your post notifications unbelievable family we out